Good day. This is Bumi Boye Fakaye, and we are looking at expect great things. Expect great things. In Acts chapter 3, we are told about a man who was lame from birth. This man was carried to the temple gate every day, I'm sure, to beg for hands from people. And on this particular day, he was at the gate as Peter and John were about to enter the temple. They saw him. They told him, look at us, as Peter told him. And this man looked at them expectantly, expecting good money that day. And they told him, silver and gold we don't have. What we have in the name of Jesus, rise up and walk. They held his hand and this man was able to walk as he received strength. He entered the temple and I declare you are receiving grace and strength today and in this new season in Jesus' name. God wants us to expect great things. In Acts chapter 3, we can see that this man expected good things from, this, uh, from Peter and John. And in Jeremiah 29 verse 11, the Bible tells us, For I know the thoughts that I have towards you, that I think towards you, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you an expected hand. God has wonderful plans for us and he wants us to expect good things, expect speed, expect favor, mercy to speak for you. This man, one thing we can note about this man was that he was also consistent. He allowed himself to be carried out every day. And God wants us to be consistent in our career, spiritually, physically, your prayer time, in your relationship, in your quiet time with God. God wants you to be consistent. And I declare, receive the grace to be sensitive to the Holy Spirit, receive the grace to be consistent. Mercy will speak for you. By the mercy of God, I declare evil verdict is cancelled. You experience the favor of God and the favor of men in Jesus' name. You are lifted beyond your imagination in the name of Jesus. Have a blessed day in Jesus' name.